Alright, hey guys, today I'm going to show you my top five favorite um, city apps. Number one, well, Gravity Board. This is called Gravity Board. So, you go to settings like this. First, you have to get it, of course. Go into another video that I'm not going to put, put it on there. Then, you scroll down to all the way to here you'll find grab mm, whoops you'll find gravity board whoops you'll find gravity board finally so activation methods you usually do and then you can like hey what happened there then so so there's the activation methods so there's with the home buttons, with the home buttons, the handset buttons, lock screen, and and stuff like that. Well, I'll leave you to that. To get to the real point, gravity board is a gravity thing. That's why it's called gravity board. So you, mine is a short hold of the home button, and. So if you tilt it that way, say, the apps go that way. If you tilt it that way, the apps go that way. And you can throw them around like that. And you can even press on them. And open it like that. So, and then it comes back to like that. All right. Number two, I, by the way, this isn't really in order. Um, number two is probably this one. I forgot what it was called, but you can just turn it like an iPad. Whoops. You can turn it like an iPad so the actual home screen rotates. And you can play with it. You can even turn it up, com whoops, completely upside down. Whoops, what did I go into? So... And let's see. Oh, this one. It's it's a, it's called Android Lock. And instead of those that slide to unlock or a passcode, you do this. So you can make a pattern. Mine, mine is nail. And you get in like that. So, oh, and the last one is this. You can, whoops, you can place your apps anywhere. So usually, when you download apps, they're only allowed to go, like, like, in a line. They go in a line. You can't put them anywhere else, but now you can. Like that. All right. And, oh, whoops, I forgot one. It is, like, so say I've, I've got my pet budgie as a background, and it's a 3D thing, so when you move it, it actually moves. So it looks, so it looks like the app's actually floating. Well, until next time, see you later.